Hello, my name is Martin Cowan, and I am the founder of the Fellowship of Reason. This is our ancient Greek language study group, and I'm doing my homework out loud in preparation for our class of Wednesday, January the 9th, 2019. Today I want to talk about the future tense and some exceptions to the formulating rules which I have talked about in a previous video. So, the exceptions involve what's known as contract verbs, and these are verbs with an ending in the stem of alpha, epsilon, or omicron. And what happens when you create the future of these is that this alpha, epsilon, or omicron are extended or lengthened to an eta or to uh, an omega. So let's look at the word uh, honor, which is an alpha contract verb, and it means I am honoring, and I'm going to do it in the active voice indicative move, present tense first. Timo, timas, tima, tim, amen, timate, tim, osi. Okay, now let's look at it in the future. And what happens here is you, the, end, the stem ending, which is an alpha, becomes an eta, which is a longer sound. You add the sigma, and then you add the appropriate uh, active voice indicative move, present tense endings. And this is to create the future. And here it is, I shall honor, etc. Timeso, timeses, timese, timesomen, timesete, timesosi. All right, so here is the verb to make or to do, which we've seen before. This is an epsilon contract uh, verb, and I'm going to read it in the present tense. Active voice indicative move, present tense. I am making, etc. Poyo, poies, poye. Poyomen, poyete, poyusi. And now we'll look at the future. What happens is, is the, the epsilon becomes an eta. You add the sigma, and then you add the appropriate first uh, active voice indicative mood, uh, present tense endings. Poeso, poeses, poese, poesomen, poesete, poesusi. And finally, we have uh, the verb that means to show, I am showing. It is delo, and this is an Omicron, Omicron contract verb, and what you do is you lengthen the um, Omicron into an Omega to create the future. But first, let's look at the active voice indicative mood present tense. De lo, de lois, de loi. De lamen, de latte, de lucy. And here is the future, I shall show. And as you can see, what happens is, is the Omicron becomes an Omega. You add the Sigma, uh, signal of the future, and then you add the appropriate uh, active voice indicative move, present tense endings. De loso, de loses, de lose, de losamen, de losete, de los usi. All right, there you have it. Those exceptions aren't too bad. Remember, I am a beginning student of ancient Greek. I am not a teacher of ancient Greek. I only play one on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.